crazy yeah. ass stuff. It's like the bearings all eaten up and it's like letting the drive shaft drop down and the U joints tag on the frame. So it just happened just now, right? When we heard the tink, 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 tink. So hopefully we can just swap it out. I think we should probably have one. Jesse's crew replaces the bad bearing and gets the trophy truck running like new. But I've already detangled my hair for the most part earlier when I put it in my crazy section. A bit of a leaky shock. The truck may be ready to race, but is Jesse. How he trains will mean the difference between finishing the race or the race finishing him. If Jesse wants to win the Baja 500, he's going to have to finish the race in just over nine hours. Dodge boulders and hit hairpin turns. The secret is to have a fast reaction time. So Jesse's got to approve his or die trying. With five days before Baja, Jesse comes to Agua Dulce, California to put his reaction time to the test. In Barstow, he fine-tuned the trophy truck. Now, he's got to fine-tune himself if he's going to make it back from Baja alive. So we invited sports physiologist David Sandler and Bob Wilson from Applied Science Laboratories to test Jesse with a device called the Eye Tracker just a camera that's going to be looking at your eye through this monocle. And this little camera is going to be looking out at what your perspective is. How accurate is it? From what we're running here, you'll probably be able to see within a, a foot or two of what you're actually looking at. The eye tracker will record Jesse's reaction time to obstacles that pop up in his path. I'm going to at least like an inch and a half. Could really. save his life in the unforgiving Baja course. Keep your head still and just rotate your eyes. So what will Jesse be dodging in this reaction time test? Landmines. We have a slalom course, if you will, set up. So an explosion's going to happen. He's got to then react to it and figure out which direction he's going to Now mind you, I'm just putting it on and I'll go back and hey, smooth it. Section. Three. As I go Coming up, Jesse James slams it into high gear at the Baja 500 and blasts the trophy truck over the edge. So I applied the relaxer to all my sections. On the driver. Now I'm going to go back and smooth those sections. Jesse will lead the team capturing the data. 
I think you want to see all right. We'll see how much force it generates, you know, when we roll it. And my hair is dyed black, and I dyed it black like three, four weeks ago with the L'Oreal kit. And it looks like it's dyeing my roots like a reddish brown. I don't know what's going on with that. Never had that happen before. Probably put a rinse on it when I'm dead, maybe. Okay, go back. And just start working it through and smoothing it. Make sure that I get up in the roots because I like my hair to be bone straight. Looks like you got about seven. Yeah. Looks like we got about seven G's. And uh, his head was hitting with an impact force of around. 200, 300 pounds or so. It's a little That's a pretty good smash on the This is only a 35 mile per hour crash test, but the truck still slammed Andrew's body around in every direction with nearly 30,000 pounds of force. If he didn't have all his safety equipment, he'd be dead. This is totally controlled. He knew he was going to roll. I think it's worse when you think everything's fine and then all of a sudden you're rolling. I don't want to roll anymore. <laughs> I don't like that feeling. Up next, it's do or die. At the Baja 500, can Jesse destroy the competition? Or will the desert destroy him? And you can add more relaxer if you need to. And I'm just going by feel to see if it's smooth or not. Insurance already? Save more with insurance's switch and save discount. It also pays to shop online. You get insurance as fast by discount just for giving an instant online quote. Uh, thanks, Professor. Don't forget the good student discount. And we'll just take the time to smooth it out. It's nothing like the good old fashioned Baja 500. Baja 500. Baja 500. Baja 500. in the world. Make sure you get your edges now too. Get the edges. 289 drivers from all over North America. Nothing makes me more mad than some crispy edges. This is one of the toughest races in the world or something. 